Vladimir Putin asks Azerbaijan and Azerbaijan to take care of the church in Nagorno-Karabakh. During the Armenian occupation of Nagorno-Karabakh, the Armenian government neglected dozens of mosques. In fact, the mosque is used as a pig pen which is clearly forbidden by Muslims to eat meat. Reflecting on that, the President of Russia, Vladimir Putin, asked Azerbaijan to continue to maintain the holy places owned by Christians in several parts of Nagorno-Karabakh. The request, according to the Kremlin Palace, was conveyed directly to the President of Azerbaijan, Ilham Aliyev on Saturday 14th of the 11th month. Nagorno-Karabakh acquired by Azerbaijan under a ceasefire agreement on Tuesday the 10th of the 11th month will begin to be handed over from ethnic Armenian rule. Russia is the broker to secure the territorial advances of Azerbaijan, which has been fighting against ethnic Armenian forces for the past six weeks. Putin told Aliyev that there are Christian churches and monasteries in the enclave, which are internationally recognized as part of Azerbaijan but are inhabited by ethnic Armenians. In this regard, President Putin underlined the importance of securing the safety and normal life of the church from these holy places, the Kremlin said. Kremlin reports, Aliyev said that is how Azerbaijan will act. This request arose because the main religion in Azerbaijan is Muslim while Armenia is a Christian majority. Putin, Aliyev and the Armenian Prime Minister, Nikol Pashinyan, also discussed the practical aspects of the ceasefire. It is unclear whether the head of state talks were held simultaneously or that Putin called Aliyev and then called Pashinyan. Since the early 1990s, ethnic Armenians have held military control over all of Nagorno-Karabakh and much of the surrounding Azeri territories. They have now lost most of the enclave itself as well as its surroundings. Local media reported Tuesday that Russian peacekeepers are now en route to Nagorno-Karabakh to be stationed there under an agreement reached between Azerbaijan and Armenia. In order to control the ceasefire and cease military action in the Nagorno-Karabakh conflict zone, a Russian peacekeeping contingent is being deployed consisting of 1,960 soldiers, 90 armored vehicles, 380 units of special vehicles and equipment, the TASS news agency reported, citing the Defense Ministry. Peacekeepers were dispatched by Il-76 aircraft from the airfield in Olyanovsk, the agency added. The contingent will largely consist of units of the 15th Separate Motor Rifle Brigade from the Central Military District, the agency reported. It is unclear exactly how many died during the conflict. Both sides deny targeting civilians but accuse the opposite side of doing so. Nagorno-Karabakh authorities said nearly 1,200 of its defense forces were killed in the fighting, and civilians were either killed or wounded. Azerbaijan has not released its military casualty figures but says more than 80 civilians were killed in the fighting, including 21 inches of missile attack on the town of Barda last month. Russian President Vladimir Putin said last month that nearly 5,000 people had died in the fighting, 